Hi! For this video, what we are going to do is find the mean and the median using the TI-84 family of calculators. Um, this could also be done in the TI-83 doing the exact same method. For this, what we are going to do is we're going to put all of this information into a list. So remember, to get to that, we hit the Stat button. And under Stat, we choose Edit. I have already entered all of the information into L1. But what you would do is you could just enter in the values. So I would just do 22, enter, 43, enter, and just continue down all of the columns until I got to the end. I have already done that um, so that you don't have to sit there and watch me type it in. If you want to clear a list, if you have information in there, you want to hit the highlight up to the top where it's highlighted on L2 or whatever list you're trying to um, clear and hit the clear button and enter and it will get rid of all of that information. If you hit the delete button, it will actually delete that list and now it goes L1, L3. So to reinstate that, like if you ever accidentally delete a list, um, if you just hit stat and option five, the setup editor and enter, it doesn't look like it's done anything. It just says that it's done. But when you go back into your edit, it does bring back your L2. So if you ever delete a list, that's how you get it back. Like I said, I've already entered all of this data into L1. So there are a total, if I go to the very bottom, it tells us that this is um, 27, row 27. So we have 27 values in here. I've already verified that all of the information is co correct. So what I'm gonna do is hit second and quit. And there are multiple ways of doing this. Because I just want the mean and just the median, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to go to second stat. Above it, it says list. This is all of our list operators. Um, and I'm gonna go over to math. And under math, we see that we have both mean and median. So I'm going to do the mean of this value. I just have to remember which list I put it in. In this case, I put it in L1, so I would hit second and the number one and enter and it tells me that the mean is approximately 31.7407 so I'm going to go to four places and that is our mean of the data set. For the median I could do the same thing if you wanted the work so that you could see the sum of those I could also do the sum in here by doing the second list math and choose option five the sum And this would tell me that the sum of all of these values were 857. So if you needed to show work what the sum of the values were, you can just hit the sum of L1 and it will give you that answer. Um, for the median, we would just go back to the same place, second stat, or where it says list, and go over to math. And this time we're going to choose option for the median. And we would do second one again. And it tells us that the median is 31. In order to find that, what the calculator did was it put all of our values in order from smallest to largest and found the very middle number since we had an odd number of data values. So hopefully you understand now how to find the mean and the median at least one way. I will show you other ways in um, different videos when we need more information. As always, thanks for watching.